Hey everyone, this is Daryl, aka The D from the Simply Incredible Podcast. Today I've got a mail call from, well, The Hut Group. And to be honest, I cannot think of which one, which box this is or whatever it is, but I just want you to notice this box is beat up really, really bad. Um, see the top of it as well. So let's see what's in here. Um, and it came as, let me see, I think it came all the way from Amsterdam. So let's see what's going on in here. And we open it up and we start off with bubble wrap. Okay. Okay, I do know what this one is. This was a, a kind of a mystery DC box. And it was kind of an expensive box. So we'll see what's going on in here. It's supposed to have some exclusive stuff and some just regular stuff. So let's see. It starts off with uh, Dorb's um, Batman from Batman v Superman, the armored one. Which, you know, I've never been big on Dorb's, but, you know, it is what it is, right? And next we have Batman Comics, um, a little 15 piece puzzle. There we go. Interesting. It does look fun. That's, that's like old school art on there. There we go. Next we have, okay. Now remember this came from Amsterdam. Okay. So we have, the, uh, the Hot Topic exclusive Aquaman, but it came from overseas, so therefore it does not have the sticker on it. There you go. That's kind of interesting. Which I already have it, but I think that's kind of interesting that it didn't have a sticker. Kind of interesting to me. And next. Okay, this is kind of cool. Ah, it's got a little tear in the box, though. Ah. We have an Underground Toys exclusive Swamp Thing. Now, I have a Swamp Thing, but I don't have an Underground Exclusive. And this one, as you can see, has a tear in it. Ah, oh, that makes me sad. And you got some damage on the top of the box, too. Ah, oh, that makes me sad, damaged box. Ah. Oh. And next, what is this right here? Oh, this is kind of cool. I I've seen some of these in a box that I didn't get. But it's the little wooden Batman with interchangeable heads. And it's kind of odd. It, his head is upside down. But that's kind of interesting. I saw one and I, mean, I do not remember which box it was. But I thought it was kind of cool. So that's kind of nice. A little Batman one there. I remember the one was an exclusive to whichever company it was. And we have an action figure. Oh, this is cool. So I do love action figures. Y'all knew that. But it is Batgirl. This is from the DC Essentials. And these figures are really, really cool. They, they usually run from for about $20 to $30. So that is pretty cool. And I, I do like Batgirl. So I think there is an icon, I believe, that I want to get. It's got Batgirl with her uh, motorcycle, which looks amazing. And then there's one, another one with uh, from... The, uh, was it, the, um, uh, Arkham Knight, <clears throat> excuse me, from Arkham Knights that has Batgirl with, uh, Oracle in the wheelchair. So I thought that, those are two really cool ones. So that is awesome. I definitely like that. So far, this is definitely the best thing in here. That is awesome. And let's see what we have here. Oh, we got Batman coasters, which is kind of cool because I actually do need coasters. And I thought about getting Batman or Harley or something like that coaster. So that is awesome. Let's see. Coaster pack. Oh, wait a minute. They're not all Batman. So I can get it open here. At least I don't think they're all Batman. All right. Oh, this is cool. We have Batman. See, they're nice and thick too. Batman. Superman. There you go. Flash. Did I have that upside down? No, I had that right. <laughs> it's <laughs> and then a Green Lantern. That's pretty cool. Like Justice League. That's awesome. 
And next, oh, this is cool. This is something that I saw and I kind of thought about getting it at one time and I never did. But it's the Dorbs ride. This is actually my first Dorbs rides right here. Wonder Woman, the Dorbs rides. So that's pretty cool. The Invisible Jet. You can see it right there. Now, uh, I thought about getting the um, the regular one, the regular pop rides, and I was like, that thing is huge. It is just massive. So, my first rides. Now, I guess I'm going to have to get the Batmobile, aren't I? <laughs> That's actually kind of cool. And let me sit that down back in the box. And one last thing is in it, and I didn't know what it was going to be, but they said it's an excuse. They're going to have a Harley statue, and there we go, a Harley statue. Now, we got a big ding in the box right there, Ugh. Ugh. but let's open it up and see. This is a Harley black and white. Be sure the statue isn't damaged, because they package these real well. So it might be damaged on the box, but not on the, uh, figure, the uh, statue. So let's see here. This will be my actually first um, black and white statue. All right. All right. Let's see if that gets it open. Right, come on now. Don't be bashful, Harley. Dang it. Thought I got this side all the way done. There we go. Ah, oh, that looks cool. And the base is the Batman logo. And you got the Harley. Let's see which way she's staying. This way. There we go. Now it's got this also. Let me get this out of here. Nope. Stay. Don't fall, Harley. So this will definitely be going in my case with all my other Harley stuff. And put that down in there. There you go. A little Harley statue. Now, you know what? I have no idea what these actually sell for, but it's all good because I did not have one of these. So this is awesome. This is my first black and white statue. Turn it a little bit. There we go. It's like Harley's blowing the gun after she just shot at Batman. That is an awesome looking figure. There we go. There's Harley. So, you know, all in all, this is a good box. Um, in my mind, I want to say this was around... Um, man, let me think around $80. I believe I paid for this, which for me, I mean, um, two pops, which, um, I actually think I have both of them. <laughs> uh, the, the, uh, oh, this one right here, the coasters I really like. And this figure right here, definitely love this. Cause I, I was looking to get a Batgirl statue or figure. So now I have one. I don't have to look anymore. And this statue right here, absolutely love it. So all in all, I think this is a, a really good box for the price I paid for. So definitely love it. Um, I'm going to have to find out actually which company I got it from because I honestly do not remember. Is it on here? Uh, do -do. I do not see it on there. I don't know. I have to find out. I do not know. But like I say, I think this is a good fun box. And again, Harley statue, Batgirl, uh, Swamp Thing, Aquaman Pops, uh, Batman Dorbs and my coasters and this little wooden guy right here and a little puzzle don't forget the little puzzle but all in all good stuff and that's all i got and you guys have an incredible day